Hello everyone and welcome back to the breakdown. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to download and install the Tekkit mod pack in Minecraft. We're going to be going over every single step of getting the Tekkit mod pack installed from downloading it to setting it up to downloading the Tekkit Technic launcher, which you need to do in order to download the Tekkit mod pack. That's a little confusing, but we're going to work through it here. First and foremost, though, we do have much more sponsor, which is Apex Minecraft Hosting. And if you want to start your very own Tekkit mod pack server, you can do so at Apex with just one click. It's simple, it's easy, and it'll get set up in under five minutes. We actually love Apex so much to be able to start our own server, play out breakdowncraft.com on them, and they are by far the easiest way to set up a ticket server, and they have great hardware to do it all, meaning your server will never lag, and stuff like that. So you can check out Apex the first link down below, the breakdown.xyz slash Apex to start your very own ticket server, or any Minecraft server you want from other mod packs to a spigot server to a vanilla Minecraft server. Apex does it all, and they are great at it. So again, you can check out Apex the first link down below, that's the breakdown.xyz slash Apex. Nevertheless, let's go ahead and get the technique launcher installed so we can get the Tekkit mod pack installed. Okay, I'll, I'll stop using them that close together, but nevertheless, but to get Tekkit, we need to install this launcher. To do that, you can go to the second link down below. That's going to take you here. This is the official Technic Launcher download page where you want to scroll down to the very bottom until you see this green Windows button. When you see that green Windows button, click on it and it will download Technic in the bottom left on Google Chrome. You may need to save it in the center of your screen if you're on Mozilla Firefox, but you shouldn't need to save it if you're on Google Chrome. Now, we minimize our browser. Here on our desktop, we do have the TechnicLauncher.exe. If this isn't on your desktop, no worries, it's going to be found in your downloads folder. To find that, click the little Windows icon to the top left of my screen, probably the bottom left of your screen. Click on that little Windows icon on the top or bottom left of your screen, and then it will open up this. You can then search Downloads. You have this Downloads File Folder in Windows. Click on that, and you will find the Technic Launcher in here. Drag it to your desktop just for ease of use. Now let's go ahead and double click on the Technic Launcher here, and it will open up this. This is the installer for Technic. To go ahead and install Tech, just click on the blue Install button in the bottom right. It will then automatically install, and once it's finished, it will open up a login box. Now here you'll enter in your minecraft.net login information. This is going to be the exact same login information that you enter in here to like change your profile or do anything like that and actually the exact same login information that you enter in the official Minecraft launcher here, right? So when you're logging into your Minecraft account to play Minecraft in the launcher, that's the information that you're going to enter right here into Technic. So I'm going to go ahead and enter that and I'll take you to the page that shows up right after you click on the login button. So here we are on the Technic launcher homepage. This is exactly where we'll be taken to whenever you get the Technic launcher logged into with your mind with your Mojang slash Minecraft login information. Now, once you're here, you want to click on the Mod Packs tab. And to install Tekkit, it's super easy. All you have to do is click on Tekkit right here. So when you click on the Mod Packs tab, you'll see Tekkit automatically on your Mod Packs page here. Click on that, and then in the bottom right, click on that blue Install button. Boom, you're done. It's going to download, install, set up everything that it needs to do to get the Technic Launcher up and running. So I'm going to go ahead, do a quick jump cut, let it download, and then once it's finished, we will see you to kind of finish off the tutorial, add more RAM, because this will need some more RAM, and then we'll be done. All right, so there we go. Techit is now downloaded. You know that because, well, this downloading progress bar disappeared there, and there is a blue play button over here. But before you smack that blue play button, I would recommend adding more RAM to the Technic Launcher, and specifically to all the mod packs you're going to play with the Technic Launcher. Now, one thing I will say is this is not an in-depth tutorial on RAM. We actually have an in-depth tutorial on RAM that talks about how to find how much RAM you can maxim add, maximally add to Minecraft and all that stuff. That's in the description down below. But as a general rule of thumb, this mod pack needs at least 3 to 6 gigabytes of RAM, depending on what you're doing with it. The more you do in game, the more RAM you're going to need with it. But to add that, you want to click on the launcher options up here in the top right. When you click on Launcher Options, it's going to open up this where you're going to see Java Settings. Click on Java Settings, and by default, it's just one gig of RAM. The mod pack might not even open with one gig of RAM. So if you've had trouble opening up tech it from the launcher before, it's probably because you haven't had enough RAM. So come in here, and I'm going to add in four gigabytes. Now, some people can't add that, and you're going to need to get a different version of Java to make sure you add it, all that stuff. That is not what we're covering here. That is in the in-depth RAM tutorial below. But... 4 gigabytes is going to be good, so if you can add 4 gigabytes and then play Minecraft here, or specifically play Tech It, you're going to be good to go. So anyway, once you've added your more RAM, you're going to need blue play button in the bottom right, and it will go ahead and open up Minecraft with Tech It installed. So yeah, there you have it. As you can see, it is opening up there in the bottom right. That's crazy that the original Tech It mod pack is still 1.6.4, and it still gets so many downloads in place. Kind of speaks to how good of a mod pack that this is. One thing I will say is that this is actually my first ever mod pack that I played, everyone. First ever mod crab mod pack I played was Tech It, and if it does this and it seems like it's frozen, seems like it's broken, that's normal. Okay, just let it let it sit, let it open. 
But here we are in Minecraft. We can click on mods and see all the different mods that Tekkit has. I'm going to click on single player, create a new world. We'll call it Tekkit, right like so, and survival, and, or sorry, creative, and jump right on in just to show you that this is working and everything's running and all that stuff. It's also such a low CPU load in comparison to these days. Wow. It's kind of crazy how Minecraft is, has changed over time. Very basic in general, but there's so many mods added. Do you really care? Nevertheless, let's go ahead and hit E here, and you will see all of the different things. I mean, it's so much that is added here. Oh, wow, this is this is too many items, everyone, not just enough items. That's too many items. That's awesome. But nevertheless, here you have it. This is this is basically everything, right? This is this is the Tekkit mod pack. It is installed, and uh, enjoy it. It has been a while since I have played this mod pack, and it's really weird to kind of revisit it here and, and to see. I mean, wow. I can't, I can't believe it. This is this, this is it. This is the Tekkit mod pack that I started with way back in the day. And you might be like, well, Nick, you're just kind of flying around a Minecraft world. And it's like, yeah, but th this is it. This is Tekkit. This is this is where kind of my mod pack love, if you will, started. So it's kind of weird to be back in this. But anyway, this isn't a video built for reminiscing, is it? No, it is not. But it is still cool that uh, this is kind of where it all started. Wow. It's Project Red. Oh man, this is some, this is some good mods. Steve Ca Steve's cards, Computer Craft, Computer Craft's OG, Mine Factory Reloaded. These are such good mods. Applied Energistics, that is a mod that I haven't heard about in a while. Build Craft. I wish a lot of these mods had updated. It's it's very sad that many of these mods have kind of went, you know, by the wayside. And some of them have updated. You know, some of them are like Galactocraft, great mod that they say is going to be updated. The developers have been working on it uh, to get it to 1.16, and I hope it does. We'll be definitely doing videos on that. If we can get that to the latest version, um, super good the developers do. Um, if we get it on the latest version, but anyway, enough of the nostalgia. Thank you all so so much for watching. Enjoy the Tekkit mod pack your, yourself. If you're new watching this video, if, if you have started playing Minecraft within the past, I don't know, seven years probably, a long time, and you've never heard of Tekkit, go back and play this. Go back and check it out. This is modded Minecraft when it first started almost, right? Modern Minecraft has been a long time before the original Tekkit pack came out. But to me, this is where Modern Minecraft all started in a big way. So um, go check this out. We have an old, or old, old Let's Play, old, old Let's Play that I don't even know if I could find anymore, but you could probably find it. It's called Modtastic. Now there was two parts to that, but the very first Modtastic episodes were on this mod pack here. So anyway, that's enough rambling. Thank you all so, so much for watching. I hope this video helped you out. If it did, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel for more awesome content, and come play with us on the best Minecraft server in the multiverse, play.breakdowncraft.com. Over there, you will find two incredible greed protected survival servers, medieval survival with 30 awesome, custom, amazing quests, and aquatic survival with a slash shop-based economy, and an incredible community with tons of awesome features. It's just, it's a great time on aquatic survival. And then we do also have 1.8 factions that was built from the ground up, completely custom. You will love it. It's got different challenges for factions and different setups and it's great. It's focused on smaller factions with only 10 people in a faction. So you and your closest friends can get together and rule the world and F top in factions on Breakdown Craft. So you can check that out in the description down below. Play it on breakdowncraft.com. We've also got Skyblock, which is getting the biggest update it's ever had very, very soon. It will literally turn Skyblock upside down with how awesome this update is. It's going to be incredible. So come play with this. Play it on breakdowncraft.com is the IP. Again, all that information is in the description down below. Thank you all so, so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Enjoy Tech It. And my name is Nick, and I'm out. Peace.